Hello everyone, Chocolate Bird here from a video review. This time we have Kinder Mini Eggs. Um, a nice little, uh, well basically Kinder Eggs is sort of a sort of egg filled with a plastic toy. Um, I don't believe there's any plastic toys in this one, but they're just uh, basically um, a bit like Kinder Bueno Mini Eggs really, if anything, rather than actually a Kinder Egg Mini. Um, so you can see there, it's kind of got that sort of middle with the hazelnuts and stuff. Um, I think it's hazelnuts. Yeah, so it's quite a nice design here. You can see the sort of circular shape with the mini eggs in there on display. A nice design, good looking rabbit. Glass of milk. <laughs> you can tell what they are really. Um, I'll say there's a nut there. Um, yeah, overall quite nice. You can see they're individually wrapped. Um, yeah, a nice design, I'd say. Um, quite nice on the back as well. Gives you a little. I'll read that out in a minute. I can't read it. To, it's back to front on my camera, but. Um, yeah, let's see what it says. So we're perfect as a little treat. And it says, have you tried other Kinder treats? So in the, the middle is basically whatever's in all the other Kinder bars, really. It's that kind of crunchy, hazelnutty, fluffy centre. In fact, milk and hazelnuts, it says there. So yeah. <laughs> um, so it says, find milk-covered mini eggs with a milky hazelnut centre. Yeah, so find milk-covered mini eggs with a milky hazelnut centre. I don't know what find milk-covered means, but... Um, Okay, let's see. Well, that's why you open it calorie wise. So, per piece, per egg, I think that means um, yeah, 29 calories, 1.9 grams of fat, 1.1 of which is saturates. This way, we give you per egg, which is good. So, knowing when you have to, you know, you should just do that. So, that's kind of why we don't. So, lots of them don't. Well, they'll say per portion, even though a portion is one egg and stuff like that. Um, so how many do we get? I hear you cry. We get um, so five, ten. We get fifteen. So fifteen eggs. So not loads. The, start, the size is a bit different than um, other eggs. It's very um, um, it's a random size, really. It's more like a it's a bit more like a suppository, really. <laughs> um, yeah, than an egg shape. Well, a bit like a rugby ball. There you go. A bit more. Uh, there you go. Put you, won't put you off your dinner as much. A bit like a rugby ball shape um, or Stewie Griffin's head shape. Um, rather than an egg, so a bit bizarre. I don't quite know why they've done that. Um, but they come in a few different colours, wrapping wise. So you can see a yellow one, a blue one, um, green one, but they've all got the sort of kinder, sort of orangey red at the bottom. Um, so quite a nice design, roughly. So you've got sort of kindery bits, a bit of butterflies on the top. That's really so yeah, because they don't need to put the calorie information stuff on these, they can make them a bit nicer. Um Okay, yeah, so uh so but yeah you can see I mean you know here's a sort of Cadbury Smarty Nestle Smarty egg, sorry. And if you compare the two, I'll put them perhaps down if I can. I don't think that's the best, best way to see them. You can see that one's this one's an egg shape, this one's a rugby ball shape. Bit of an odd one that's all I'm sure the Kinders is it's Italian, I'm quite sure eggs in Italy aren't lovely ball shaped. <laughs> and here's a Cadbury's uh, dairy milk egg. Good job. So, uh, so you can see um, again. Try to hold them. It's hard to hold them. So you can see, there you go. So you can see this is an egg shape roughly. That's a rugby ball shape. So yeah, a bit of a strange decision there by Kinder, but um, there you go. I guess it doesn't really matter. I'm sure Kinder eggs are actually egg shaped. I'm sure they're not rugby ball shaped. So yeah, you can see here. So emphasis even more. It's clearly a rugby ball. Um, yeah. So measurement wise, let's have a look. So top to bottom, about three point eight centimeters, and width wise, about one point eight. Okay. So let's uh, have a look in the middle. Okay. So there we go, so you've got the sort of the creamy centre. It's not liquid, it's um, very solid actually. I'm not getting any sticky off it, so it's very, very much a solid. So that's what fine milk is, apparently. Solid milk. <laughs> um, and you can see just little bits and pieces in there, the crunchy hazelnut bits. So I imagine these are very similar to the other Kinder things. I can't remember the call them. Kinder Choco Bonds, is it? I think they're basically these. I think they're circular, these are just rugby ball shapes. So maybe they've done them more of an exaggerated shape to make them different, I don't know, but. Hmm. Very nice, actually. Hmm. 
I'm not a big hazelnut or nut fan generally. Um, that's quite a nice taste actually. Hmm. I think I quite like the choco bonds when I have them as well. I can't quite remember whether these are. You know, I can't. Unfortunately, I can't remember the taste precisely to say whether these are exactly the same or not. But that, to be honest with you, I'm quite sure they will be. You get a hint of hazelnut, but um, not aggressively so. It's quite subtle. It's quite nice. In the middle of the fine milk, <laughs> whatever that is, is a nice taste. It's better than the Cadbury's vanilla, you know, fluffy mousse taste. I think, you know, which is just a bit. Um, I don't know, not not overly keen on that, but I mean, you know, and that 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 fluffy vanilla mousse is what they have in the Oreo ones and the um, and their bunny rabbit one, and yeah, they do that, yeah, for Easter. Um, I prefer this, and the chocolate's not the best, but it's very much Kinder chocolate, you know. Um, but it's more about the inside, you know. The the inside is the massive there. Uh, you know, the chocolate's quite thin. Not thinner than on the Cadbury's um, miniature eggs they do, um, but the inside's nice and the the sort of the um, hazelnut pieces on the middle uh, add a different texture. Don't overly taste of anything. Um, you know they taste just a subtle taste of hazelnut. So overall, I think these are quite nice. I don't think you have your socks bowled off though. <laughs> socks bowled off. <laughs> socks blown off. And then we'll be bowled away, <laughs> mixing my metaphors. Um, um, so I think a three and a half out of five for me. I think the chocolate bonds, I seem to remember preferring them to these. I don't know if it's just the ratio or what. Um, I think I was more impressed with those than these, but they might be very similar. So it could just be either <clears throat> my tastes have changed um, since I had those, or these are just not quite the same. I, I think these are just not quite as convincing, I think. To be honest with you, um, but they're still nice. But I don't think um, they're anything too different than the regular Kinder products that they have out there. Just a different shape, and they're not really even egg shaped either. You know, which is a bit of an odd one. Um, so yeah, not overly convinced by that. It's probably the weakest shape wise. All the others have been egg shaped. That I've had, I've had all the other you know, Easter related miniature eggs. These these ones are the only rugby ball ones I've had. But if you want like Stewie Griffin and you want to make a little mini Stewie. This will probably help <laughs> um, if you haven't got any rugby balls to hand. <laughs> okay, well, I hope you enjoyed that review. Um, follow me on Twitter, subscribe, things like this. Let me know you think, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care. Bye for now. <laughs> see ya.